Welcome esteemed participants to the esteemed enclave of V groups. We are gratified to announce our felicitous alliance with Anaga Health as our esteemed channel partner. Within the confines of this illustrious congregation, we shall embark upon a cerebral odyssey delving into the intricacies of a chosen discourse. Anaphylaxis management using an EpiPen involves administering epinephrine, also known as adrenaline, to quickly counteract the severe allergic reaction. Here's a general outline of how it's typically done. 1. Recognize symptoms. Anaphylaxis can present with various symptoms, including difficulty breathing, swelling of the face or throat, hives, rapid heartbeat, nausea, vomiting, and dizziness. It's crucial to recognize these symptoms promptly. 2. Administer epinephrine. If you suspect someone is experiencing anaphylaxis and they have access to an EpiPen, use it immediately. Remove the EpiPen from its case. 3. Prepare the site. Typically, the thigh is the recommended injection site for epinephrine. Make sure the area is exposed and ready for the injection. 4. Remove safety cap. Hold the EpiPen firmly with the orange tip pointing downward. Remove the blue safety cap from the other end of the Epi Pen. 5. Administer injection. Swing and firmly push the orange tip of the Epi Pen against the middle of the outer thigh, through clothing if necessary, until it clicks. Hold it in place for a few seconds, usually around 10 seconds, to ensure the full dose is delivered. 6. Seek emergency medical assistance. After administering the Epi Pen, Call emergency medical services immediately, 911 or local equivalent. Even if the symptoms seem to improve after the epinephrine injection, it's essential to seek further medical attention, as anaphylaxis can sometimes recur or worsen. 7. Additional steps. While waiting for emergency services, you may consider helping the person into a comfortable position, such as lying on their back with their legs elevated. If they are having difficulty breathing, if they have a history of anaphylaxis and carry additional medications, such as antihistamines or inhalers, assist them in taking those as prescribed. 8. Monitor. Stay with the person and monitor their condition closely until medical help arrives. Be prepared to provide CPR if necessary. It's crucial to remember that administering epinephrine via an EpiPen is a temporary measure to alleviate symptoms and buy time until emergency medical assistance can be obtained. Anaphylaxis can be life-threatening, and prompt action is essential for the best possible outcome.